All right, so we're gonna talk about how to tension the system and lower uh, using ropes. So we just have the rope bag sitting right here, nothing special. Um, the two clutches are holding the ropes uh, entirely. Um, so, all right, we've dragged out 20 feet of rope past the tip of the truck. Um, and at the stokes, we raised it up a little bit, but we noticed that the uh, red rope is holding most of the tension. So what do we do to, keep, to get equal tension? We're gonna, by keeping, so let's say blue is in stop, we're just gonna put it in standby and we can give a little tug. And now we're in equal tension. So do the same with the red. You can feel it, they're both equally tensioned. Uh, you would see slack in one of them and you'd see that one of them is holding uh, the majority of the tension. But uh, right now they are equally tensioned. So that's how you would make sure that the system is equally loaded. Now let's say um, we've got the ladder extended all the way out with the stokes over where we wanna go, um, but we can't lower anymore or with height restrictions, we've got a parapet wall and we wanna use ropes to lower um, the stokes down to the ground level so we can either load the patient or pick the patient up um, from there. So with the clutches, we can do this one-handed. So I open up my levers, flip them over and with both hands I am I'm feeding the rope out right now I just have guy hanging off the end so there's not much tension but what I'm doing is I'm keeping equal tension in both levers and I'm mar watching my tracers the two uh, black and gold tracers on either rope and as I open up the release I'm kind of helping feed it through if we had a live load in there or victim you would uh, see it pull a lot more. I think we're pretty much on the ground right now. So I can put a little more tension in the system and we can start over. So let's say the ropes are locked off. We wanted to stop. All I need to do if I want to lower is open them up. Feel those clicks, it's gonna swing around and using one hand, I'm kind of holding on to both ropes just to help guide it through. And as I'm pushing, I feel the tension open up and there we go. We're good. That's how to do that. Now let's say I was lowering and too fast and I hit anti-panic. The ropes are locked off and the patient will not fall out of, uh, or the ropes will not fall through the system. So now ropes are down, we're done lowering. We can lock off each one into stop and we're good to go. We can raise the ladder up over a parapet and uh, continue on our operation.